me show you. I'm in Bellano Beach in St. Augustine, Florida. Oh, so that is a Portuguese man of war. And those guys are spicy. So they may look like jellyfish, but Portuguese man of war are not actually jellyfish. They're in the same phylum, phylum Nidaria, which also includes things like sea anemones and coral. However, jellyfish and the Portuguese man of war are different things. So the Portuguese man of war are what are known as hydrozoans. They're again in the phylum Nidaria. But what's interesting about them is they're not actually just one Thing. They're a colonial organism, which means there's a bunch of teeny tiny organisms all conglomerated together to form this one big colony. So the big kind of blue bubble that you see in the video that I stitched, that is called the gas body or gas bladder or whatever, and it's not like, it can't sting you. That part is essentially totally safe to touch because there's no stinging cells on it. The purpose of the gas body is to keep it afloat on the water and act as transportation. Now the part that you need to worry about are the tentacles. They're, I don't know if they're technically tentacles, but same function. The tentacles have what are called nematocysts, which are the stinging cells, and those are what you need to worry about. Now. There haven't been, like, it's not fatal if you get stung by a Portuguese man of war. You're not going to die unless you have some sort of bizarre allergic reaction and go anaphylactic. But it hurts like a bitch. You really, really don't want to get stung by these because it is super painful and it can cause a nasty rash that can last for, like, a very long time. It is overall not a good idea to touch these. It's not a good time if you manage to get stung by the tentacles. And how the nematocysts work is they are touch triggered. They're triggered by physical touch so they can still be triggered after death because they're still loaded. All of these cells are loaded until a mechanical stimulus fires them and that can still happen after death. So even if the Portuguese man of war is fully dead, it can still sting you. So if you see these on the beach, it is not a good idea to touch them. So yeah, Portuguese man of war, they're very interesting. They're very cool looking. Just don't touch it and you might be in for a very bad time if you do.